Hey guys, what's going on? Nivens here. Time for your weekly rock wind up. The first installment for the month of October. Later on this month, out in San Bernardino, California, Knot Fest goes down. Of course, the uh, weekend festival put on by Slipknot. <laughs> and this week, Clown was talking about some of the other, I guess you'd call it amenities that they'll have on hand, like burning camel poop. It gives off a very distinct odor and he very much likes to correlate odors with memories because he always talks about when he smells fresh cut grass, it reminds him of home. So this way, when you go to Knotfest and you smell burning camel shit, maybe down the road you'll be at a zoo or maybe you'll be at a carnival and you'll smell it and you'll be whisked away back to Knotfest. Well, in case you missed it, I reported last week that ACDC will be putting out an album later on this year, Rock or Bust. Uh, as many people know, it will not have Malcolm Young being replaced by uh, him and Angus's nephew, Stevie. And this week, it was confirmed by his family, Malcolm does have dementia. Uh, and they are asking the family is that you uh, respect their privacy at this time. So a, a bum deal, but you know, when you've been rocking for, what, 40 some years now, 40 years, yeah, it's a good life, you know, but uh, still, condolences to him and his family. Well, as announced this week, it looks like Sabbath's got one more in them. They're going to work on a new album for next year and then subsequently the final tour. And speaking of Black Sabbath, it seems that Tony Iommi, guitarist, uh, has taken up his uh, stint as professor at Coventry University in the UK. Professor of music. Can you imagine having that guy as your teacher? And to close out your weekly rock windup, new jam announcements, new stuff, if you will. Of course, Led Zeppelin 4 and Houses of the Holy going to be reissued on October 28th when Jimmy Page was having a press conference about it. Again, he was asked about the, the one-off reunion from Zeppelin, saying pretty much it's not in the cards, it's not going to happen. He is contemplating, however, getting out and doing some touring next year with the band that he puts together, and it will celebrate his entire catalog going all the way back to the Yardbird days. Of course, uh, Man on the Run from Bush comes out on the 21st of this month. This week, we saw the, one of the first videos, uh, The Only Way Out. Uh, Mastodon dropping a new video this week for the mother load where it shows a bunch of girls in a dance off or a twerk off. Uh, some people have slammed it as a sexist uh, video. Uh, basically, Mastodon has said, like, dude, you guys are taking it too seriously. These women were empowered to have a dance off. That's all it is. Get over it. DJ Ashba saying Guns N' Roses planning some extensive touring in 2015 and maybe even putting out an album. Whoa, how about that, huh? Uh, Rob Cagliano of, uh, of Volbeat saying that the band will get back into studio and put out new stuff next year. Of course, those guys will be down in Wichita on Monday the 20th with Five Finger Death Punch, Hell Yeah, and Nothing More. That will be a hell of a show. Uh, hopefully, we will see new Motorhead. Lemmy saying that they will probably get in the studio in January to follow up last year's Aftershock, which didn't really have any touring to go along with it. And DMAC! Daryl McDaniels launching his brand new comic book line. Uh, he started up the uh, the uh, Daryl Makes Comics line, and now he's going to have his debut comic for that, uh, DMC. It'll be unveiled later on this month at the New York Comic Con up in uh, New York City. There you go. I'm Nivens. Thank you very much for tuning in to Weekly Rock Windup. Of course, it is a huge weekend in sports for Kansas City. you got the boys in blue going at it tonight, and hopefully uh, advancing after this weekend. Of course, you've got the Chiefs on Sunday out in San Francisco taking on the 49ers after their throttling of the Patriots on Monday Night Football where they literally kicked the hell out of them. And uh, oh yeah, there's American Royal Barbecue and the races out of the Kansas Speedway. So whatever it is you're doing, be safe, be smart, have a good one. I'll see you there. Peace. I wonder if you have Chip send in a resume to be a <laughs> scooper. <laughs> what are your qualifications? Mm, I picked up dog poop for a summer. And my, my uncle's farm. I've been trying to I got three kids. I change the diapers on a regular basis. I'm trying to upgrade camel poop for about two years now. Earn my degree. Think I'm ready. I'm, I'm ready. All <laughs> to live all day.